everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Janet to those who are new and to those who have been subscribed to this channel thank you so much for your support I really appreciate it and then moving on to today's business hmm guys today's business <laughs> oh I don't I don't even know where to start so what happened is I bought some kids uh, masks mask for, for COVID right mask for COVID so I and I don't know how I communicated I don't know how I communicated with this seller but then in my mind every time i was thinking i'm buying 200 boxes please not 200 boxes of these in my mind that's what i was thinking but then mind of the seller he was selling me one not even one you know when someone says okay when you're buying on on alibaba every time the language the business language is how many pieces are you buying so with me what i thought with the price which was being given what i was thinking was what he meant about per piece was the box only to find out guys guys <laughs> only to find out that when he's saying per piece he means one mask inside so inside there are 50 masks so for him he was selling 50 pieces and me here here i was thinking that i'm buying 50 boxes and not what he meant because i have i've never bought masks before it was my first time so i thought it was just like clothes i'm always buying bags i'm always buying shoes i'm always buying clothes so when he said per piece i was thinking per box i never thought he meant per mask so guys the 200 pieces are here one two and three These are the 200 pieces I got. And the other reason which uh, made me think I was buying 200 boxes is the price, guys. I had to compare these masks with other masks. There are those other masks which um, are like helmets, which obviously were going at a fair price than buying a box of this. So I obviously thought it was a box because of the pricing as well. Not knowing that uh, they are actually way more expensive. So for starters, this was my mistake. The language between me and the person who was selling children's masks. We really did not understand each other. I didn't expect to get four boxes. I expected to get 200 boxes the amount which i paid and then when my things got at the customs my shipping agent then communicated with me and then he was like did you buy anything to do with covert items i was like yes i did and i was thinking this um i had 200 boxes right so when he was like, oh, they are expecting you to pay more. I was like, okay, it's fine because there are 200 boxes. Mind you, these 200 boxes. And these are the boxes. Four boxes. Four boxes, guys. And the customs of Zimbabwe wanted to make me pay more. On top of the fact that I pay my shipping agent, uh, transportation money and duty money, I was supposed to pay more for these four boxes. I was supposed to pay 60 US dollars. $60 US dollars for these four. 
and then my argument my argument with my shipping agent was but how can i be paying for duty if you charge me with uh transport it doesn't make sense for me to to top up with 60 bucks and i'm thinking they're 200 bucks i was like okay we'll discuss when i get to the office and see if um if i can pay more money i'll see how much i'm supposed to pay you and then maybe i can then uh just pay more money for the boxes guys oh business is not for the faint hearted business is not for the faint hearted i repeat the cost of these four boxes guys i cannot sell them for less than 10 bucks each and i had told i had actually advertised advertised the kids masks earlier and um i had put a cost price i had already put a cost price that they're going to cost five dollars and to be honest pay each box the cost was more than five dollars i can't even sell them for less than 10 bucks because i'll be making a huge huge loss Yeah, so that's what happened and I had to apologize. I had to apologize for everyone who ordered them There were people who ordered 50. There were people who ordered two three some five Luckily, I don't take people's money uh, up front. I just um, Get uh, their money when I'm delivering their goods. That's it but yeah there, there was a special case of one person who had paid up front whom i'm supposed to just uh refund because honestly i cannot pay i cannot sell them for five bucks it would be a major disaster for me i have to just uh rethink a strategy i really love the quality though of the masks they are really amazing i opened one box for my kid though he's too young for this and this is what i got these are super cute for for kids they're easy it's easy for them to breathe through them they are just uh cute as well the 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 whole um decor which is there makes it a uh, more super cute for a kid to want to wear such a mask but then i don't know with the pricing the pricing is just too high i don't know if i will order more of them because you discover that i also use disposable masks and in our case this uh these uh masks cost these masks cost um five dollars and they're 50 inside so you know judging with that because i had done my research judging with the fact that adult uh disposable masks cost uh five dollars in the supermarkets i was like ah obviously kids masks will cost five dollars and when i was buying them back in china i was thinking ah you know what i'm buying per piece per box because the pricing made sense the pricing made sense and i calculated my um shipping agent uh fee and the pricing made total sense but then with what happened afterwards this then the pricing the five dollars didn't make any sense at all so i don't know what to do the best way to move forward with this but then maybe i'll find other sellers whom i will talk to and then maybe we can make um good deals because i really liked i really liked the the masks they are really good they are easy to breathe they are um, soft they are um, here it's written on the specs that um they're soft and easy to breathe through 
fluid resistant they're fluid resistant you know kids play around a lot and they'll be just playing all over and they are these are uh, hygiene and protection they're protected from a whole lot of things but then whew, these masks were just way too expensive okay guys I don't know whether to be disappointed I don't know what <laughs> what to even think but what I know is you know what this happens in business uh, business is not for the faint-hearted you just don't have to give up because of of, of one incident so I'll try and um, do more business pertaining the mask find out more obviously i didn't do much of my research because um, i discovered that also at our customs they require more money for masks because they're covid material i don't know why they would require more money because i mean they're just masks so it proves that i didn't do much of my homework so i'll do more of my homework and um i'm hoping to to sell this because I mean this was actually something which I wanted to invest in in my business and to help out in the community because um, in China when I was staying in China I discovered that uh, almost everyone wears almost everyone in China wears masks before the pandemic happened almost everyone used to wear masks mainly because of the um, of their environment i mean because of their climate and because of the fact that um the air there is not safe so uh kids and adults wear masks uh to make sure that uh they don't uh, breathe a lot of that air because it affects your lungs and everything if you would when if you would go out without a mask you'll actually feel it the air is really humid so i was thinking i would actually invest in these and be able also to just help out in this uh in these trying times of corona so i would definitely try and um do my research and make sure that i'll be able to actually supply this i really want to but then oof, my first my first experience has been a nightmare so far i need to just find other vendors and sellers who would want to partner with me and in order for us to achieve this oh i hate disappointing my clients my customers uh and just telling them that uh the masks um I was changing the prices of the masks and some I didn't get all my stock uh, was just heartbreaking to me because I like delivering I like uh, satisfying my clients so I'm hoping that um, the because I, I got because I really got an overwhelming like response in terms of masks thank you so much to the moms who wanted to buy masks uh, it showed that um, people are really taking uh, this pandemic seriously um, and they want to keep uh, their children safe. I'm hoping as well that um, well I'll be able to do this business. So this is it for me, you guys. So this is it for me. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Guys, uh, please tell your family, your friends, to subscribe to support a fellow system let's get to 100 guys let's get to 100 so don't forget to like share and subscribe